Yamaha at the end of August released the latest generation of 150cc sports. This variant is to attack the 150cc market after their success in the naked quarter liter class. Yamaha is hitting the market again with the FZ15 Phaser. As the name implies, don't be surprised if the design of this motorbike is handsome even though he still relies on a tubular model frame instead of a delta box like most naked Yamaha motorbikes. His figure is no less dashing. Even from a few points the Yamaha FZ15 Phaser looks more authoritative. Just take a peek at his figure from the front and side. Fierce enough for the size of a motorbike with a box swing arm, tubular diamond chassis and a fairly small engine. Yep, the engine that the Yamaha FZ15 Phaser carries is only a 149 cc SOHC2 valve capable of spewing power up to 12.2 horsepower at 7,500 revolutions per minute with a maximum torque of 12.7 Nm at 6 revolutions per minute. What is another advantage is that the Yamaha FZ15 Phaser is packed with two types of brake devices, namely ABS and UBS. For the UBS, the system works similarly to Honda's CBS, so it's just a different patent name. Telescopic model front suspension and monoshock rear monocross model that can be adjusted hardness. The cool thing is that standard tires already use Pirelli. The Yamaha FZ15 Phaser is sold quite high for a standard motorbike spec size. Yamaha Brazil pegged at RS 16,990 Brazilian real. We certainly don't expect much because Yamaha focus is not on sports. They consider this market to be less profitable in terms of profit, so it will not be of particular concern. The focus is on the Maxi scooter which has been their rice barn so far. Are you guys interested in the Yamaha FZ15 Phaser?